Hello everybody and welcome to our virtual classroom. This is our online lesson. Today we are on page 58, unit 4, lesson 2, part 2, Andy's Town. Now we are going to study a new lesson about where the places are on Andy's map. So, I am ready. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's see what we are going to do at this lesson. Today at the lesson, we are going to practice and learn about directions, places on the map of Andy's town. At the beginning, prepare please your copy books and exercise books, pens to make notes, and write new words in your copy books. Take a look at the screen. Please read the sentence along with me. Andy lives an old town in the north of Moldova. His town is not very large. There are a lot of new buildings in it. There are some old churches in the town. The oldest church is on Stefan Chelmari Street. It is the main street of the town. There is a large public library in the center. And the school is next to the public library. His house is behind the school. There is a post office and a new block of flats near the school. The supermarket is between the new block of flats and the post office. There is an old park in the neighborhood. Andy and his friends often play there. Well, I think you are ready to look again at the text and answer the questions in exercise 4, page 59, using the words from the box. So, this is exercise 4, page 59. You have the first word from the box in front of. Next, behind. The other one, next to. Between. And the last one, near. Now, first question. Where is the oldest church? You have the time to think. Ready? Let's check the answer. The answer is the oldest church is on Stefan Chalmari Street. The second question, where is the public library? Now you have time to look through the text and find the answer. Are you ready? Let's check. The answer. The public library is in the center next to Andy's school. Next question. Where is Andy's school? You have the time. You can press the button pause. Are you ready? Let's check. The answer, it is next to the public library. Next question, where is Andy's house? You have the time to think. Ready? Done? Okay. The answer, his house is behind the school. The next question. 
Where is the supermarket? Press the button pause to think. Here's the answer. The supermarket is between the new block of flats and the post office. The sixth question, where is the post office? Again, you have time to look through the text. Done? Great, let's check. The answer, there is a post office near the school. And the last question, where is the park? Press the button pause. Ready? Let's check together. The answer, there is an old park in the neighborhood. I think that now you are ready for the practice time. Look at the screen. Here are the some phrases from exercise 5, page 59. Look at them and make a mini dialogue with Look at the screen. Here are the some phrases from exercise 5, page 59. Look at them and make a mini dialogue with them in four or five sentences. So, first one. Excuse me, where is? The second, it is. Thank you. You are welcome. I am waiting for your answer. You should write it down in your copy books. You can press the button pause. Are you ready? Let's check together. The answers could be Excuse me, where is the post office? It's near the bank. Thank you. You are welcome. And now it's the reflection time. I propose you to describe in five, six sentences your city, town or village. Here are the end of the lesson. Let's see what we have learned from this lesson. From this lesson, I am taking with me how to talk about the position of things, places and people in space to make a dialogue. Now I would like to wish you a good day and see you at the next lesson. You are amazing pupils. Goodbye.